Hi. So, um, <laughs> it's been a while, and, um, boy, has it been a while. So, I decided I needed to do a critique. <laughs> oh, you guys are so patient with me, and I love it. I really appreciate it. So, first of all, um, I don't want to make anybody uncomfortable. Um, this particular one, you know, Ben-Hur isn't a big deal for a lot of people, but this one has a strong Bible theme. So, if that bothers you, <laughs> go ahead and just turn it off right now. <laughs> You're not going to hurt me a bit. <laughs> I have no problem with that, but I really don't want anybody to feel uncomfortable. So, um, but yeah, this particular one that I found does have, um, that particular thing. You're going to find it. Um, but again, I don't want to make anybody uncomfortable. So if that does, <laughs> Go ahead and turn it off. You're not going to hurt me any. <laughs> but I don't want any of my viewers to be uncomfortable. So anyway, this was released in 1905. Apparently it's, because see, I couldn't find a lot on it. So this is another one that's a little, because again, we're doing the silent film shorts. I decided to do short, very, very short. I decided, you know, why not? Give a month, show tribute to some of these really tiny films. <laughs> um, I decided, why not? <laughs> um, but this particular one... Can't find a lot. <laughs> but apparently is part of a series... Um, and, you know, to be quite honest with a lot of these shorts, kind of like what Georges Melez did with his, part of a series, he had that series thing going on, he had them numbered and everything, so, it's, when you find these short films, the very short films that are less than 10 minutes, you find that. Um... This one, however, okay, so when I go on Internet Movie Database, it's a, it's French, and I'm going to put it in the description because I'm really afraid of butchering it, but the series apparently is a bunch of fairy tales. This one, however... It's not so much a fairy tale. Of course, I know how a lot of people... It just goes with people's belief. Let's just be respectful. Um, yeah. Um, but I guess the English translation is Christian Martyrs. That's what it looks like. But it's grouped in with what's called fairy tales. So I guess that there's this whole, um, short film series by this, oh, who was it? What was his name? Lucian, and I'm not even going to try his last name. But I'll, of course, put the director's name, and, um... But I guess he did this entire series that's based off fairy tales, and this was just placed in, this, uh, Christian Martyrs. And in 1905, seven minutes long, and it shows stories like, uh, it's, it's graphic. I was kind of surprised when I was watching because it, when you first watch it, it doesn't seem biblical. I almost thought that it was like a 
because you you know about the early version like the 1907 version of Ben-Hur I was like did is this like an earlier version of Ben-Hur because you see almost like a lion tamer messing with a lion but then it, it you know you kind of think okay so this is kind of like an acrobat ancient Rome kind of a thing and then it goes dark <laughs> But it does three different stories from the Bible, and like, uh, I think it's Balthazar's Feast, I think that's how you say the name, I should know, I went to church for years, grew up in the church. <laughs> Look how that's working for me. Um, and then, so that's like the last one. And then it has um, Daniel in the Lion's Den. And... Oh no, Daniel in the Lion's Den was the last one, and then there's the Balthazar scene, the, you know, the feast scene, but there's like the torturing of Christians, and this other scene, you see like the, a Christian being put on um, a cross, you see another one being ripped apart, I mean, there's like guts everywhere, so, <laughs> I just got the two mixed up, I don't know why. But, um, this one, the, um, video itself is, um, like sepia tone. It's like a very dark sepia tone. It's interesting to me because the special effects, when they have, like, the, the angels show up, this isn't like your usual angel. I I was really interested in that. Um, you know, because we've seen angel like you always see the angel with the big wings and everything, and this was different. So uh, that was really interesting to me. But and then of course the feast. That was pretty well done, actually. Because, um... You don't know how the feast works. You know, they had, like, the hand that was writing on the wall. So you had that. And, of course, the people at the feast were reacting. The whole scene was actually very well done. It, it could have been done... It, it was... I'm getting ahead of myself. The way it was done then was just as good as if it had been done today. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I was, you know, I was just surprised with how gory it was. I, I don't think I've seen something that gory yet. <laughs> it, it just shocked me. But, um, because <laughs> I'm watching all of a sudden, I'm like, oh, oh. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> but, um, it makes me curious to see what he did in his other, in the fairy tales, you know? You know, because you would kind of expect it with Grimm's fairy tales, considering how dark they were, because in the Grimm's fairy tales, the stepsisters cut off their heels and toes to slip into the shoe. <laughs> A lot of people don't remember that. They don't think of it because they're so used to the Disney version. <laughs> and, um... Yeah, but... So anyway, um... So this is only seven minutes. Seven minutes long. Um... It's from... It's, it's a French film. 
It's part of a series, apparently with a bunch of fairy tales. It. I'm curious why it was thrown in with the fairy tales, because... I don't know, maybe it's because of how he feels, <laughs> the, the director feels. I would see that happening. Maybe he thought that these were fairy tales. But again, you know, let's just be respectful of people's beliefs. <laughs> we don't need any more of that. You know, I, I don't need my comments spammed with stuff like that. But anyway, um... But it's possible. It's possible that he threw these in with the fairy tales because that's how he felt. That's what he believed. I can see that. Um, so, yeah, 1905, French. I'm not going to try his name. It's... I'm just going to... I think it's Lucien... Lucien But I'm not going to say his last name because I'm afraid of butchering it. <laughs> um, the special effects are really good. Again, that angel was so different. You know, we've there have been other films that I've critiqued and you see an angel. It's got the big flowy wings that you're used to. You know, a pretty stereotypical angel. This one was not depicted as the same kind of an angel. So, I, I was impressed by that. And again, it is gory. Of course, you're going to look at it and you're, you're probably going to watch it and you're like, it's not that gory. <laughs> for silent film standard for 1905, gory. <laughs> Let's put it in that. But anyway, um, it is worth... Watch it, it again. It is a sepia tone. It, it's the darker sepia tone. It's not the light sepia. It's it's the darker tones, more brownish. So um, and again, it starts out really interesting because it you see this like lion tamer playing with a. I mean, it's it's almost like a a circus kind of a show. I was confused by it. And then it got dark. <laughs> it got dark fast. So anyway, um, it does look like part of a series. I will look up the series, try to find more possible. Maybe the rest of it is lost. Probably not, since I said it. Because <laughs> we all know how that goes for me. <laughs> um... But anyway, yeah, it is part of a series by this director. Um, oh, what does it say here? Give me a second here. Early color films from... Well, I will put that there. I will put the name of it. Uh, the fairy tales, what it's saying here. And, um, so that you guys can look it up as well. Um, because, you know, I'm so busy with what I'm doing here. But anyway, um, because if, like I said, I, I know that this particular subject matter does make people uncomfortable. So if this, you can at least look up the other stuff that he did that was part of this series so so it's not um because <laughs> the last thing i want to do is make you guys uncomfortable but um anyway so yeah it's it's seven minutes for those of you that do want to watch it it's seven minutes long um the special effects are actually really impressive like i said that angel is really cool and that feast scene if if you're familiar with it yeah it, it was pretty well done for 1905 standards <laughs> it could be yeah anyway <laughs> i said it once i'm not gonna say it again 
I will put all the information where I usually put it, and I will also put the information for the rest of the series so that, given how I know that this particular subject matter makes some people uncomfortable, you can look up his other stuff. So, <laughs> um, yeah, because like I said, I don't want to make you guys uncomfortable, but I feel like I did. Um, but anyway, um, yeah, the name of it, I totally glossed over that, is Christian Martyrs, um, and it's part of a series called Fairy Tales. So, there you go. <laughs>